A spin and win sends a modified champion into the Sizzler spotlight. The 2005 running of the Spring Sizzler was held under sunny but cool conditions. A large field of 43 cars checked into the pits on Saturday to qualify for 33 spots. Donnie Leah would claim the pole, lapping the half mile at 97.8 miles per hour. Nevin George led the field to the green by virtue of the pre-race redraw, while Leah started from fourth spot. George would lead the opening 28 laps before 2003 champion Todd Zegedy would take over the top spot. Moments later, Tony Hirschman would spin while challenging George for the second spot. There would be no damage to Hirschman, but there would be no yellow either, causing Hirschman to lose several positions as a result. Zegedy would lead the next 27 circuits until Ted Christopher made his presence known at the front of the field, taking the top spot on a lap 56 restart, and the 13 Mystique team would hold on to the lead for the next 68 laps. There were nine yellows in total, with one of those claiming early race favorite Mike Stefanik after he made heavy contact on lap 38, relegating the former champion to a 33rd place finish. While Christopher held the lead, Hirschman was making his way back through the field in his number 48 Chevrolet, finding himself towards the front during a lap 121 caution flag. Jamie Tomeno would lead on the restart, but it would be short-lived as Hirschman got by him to take the lead on lap 129. Pole winner Donnie Leo would crash on lap 196, setting up a two-lap dash to the finish. Hirschman would hold off SK Modified standout Zach Sylvester by just three-tenths of a second at the checkered flag. It would be Hirschman's first spring sizzler win and second consecutive victory at Stafford, after a spin on lap 28 dropped the 48 car outside the top 20. The win was the first of a five-win campaign for Hirschman in 2005, leading to him winning the NASCAR Modified Tour Championship. Mark your calendars for the 50th running of the greatest race in the history of spring. For Sunday, April 24th, the 100 lap open modified event will culminate a busy weekend of racing that also includes the Napa Auto Parts dual qualifying races on Saturday, April 23rd. See the full schedule and order your tickets today at StaffordSpeedway.com.